Hello everyone, this is Zen. Today I'm going to be making a video on Corium and some recent updates and tell you what's important about this guy. So today the Corium team wanted to give a warm welcome to the new Golong developer. His name's Adolfo Alvera from Argentina. Adolfo is a published author on operating systems management with vast experience in the IT field and innovative blockchain ecosystems. Welcome to the core team, core roles. So um, remember the metaphor we've constantly shared that Sologenic is the Microsoft Excel spreadsheet and Corium is designed to be basically the Microsoft, the OS, the operating system for the um, Microsoft Excel spreadsheet to run on. So that Corium is actually built to expand the capabilities of the Sologenic ecosystem. So we're gonna talk all about that. So Adolfo, one of the cool things I noticed about his resume He'd work with a lot of, you know, top level people from Exxon Mobil to a bunch of other plays, lots of experience, uh, Amazon. So he recently was at Amazon, a software engineer at Amazon. That's pretty big. But most importantly, what I want to show you guys, because we've been talking about, you know, um, Cosmos being connected to uh, Corium because Corium is using Tendermint Core. So Cosmos SDK are written in the Golong programming language. Corium is being built off the uh, uh, Cosmos SDK. So what capabilities? So what will you build? Developers in the Cosmos are pioneers of a new era of blockchain technology. Join the fast growing token economy. Build upon a new secure and stable foundation. You could have decentralized finance. Here, this is a better page. So part of the Cosmos SDK, Tendermint Core. But uh, what? here's a list of blockchain use cases for inspiration. So this is all the capabilities, open finance, uh, gaming, healthcare, uh, prediction markets, cross-border payments, uh, connecting chains, act as a payment router between many connected blockchains, provide security and prevent double spend transactions, real estate, Remember, we've always talked about possibly there being real estate on uh, the Sologenic Dex. So Cosmos SDK features uh, scalable, interoperable, secure, proof of stake, sovereign. Uh, proposed changes and vote on blockchain upgrades with governance module. Uh, open source. I think this is what I want to show you here. Uh, what will you build? Uh, well, you could build resilient autonomous organizations, empower your community to organize and allocate resources to its members, vote on impactful governance decisions. That's what I'm most excited. We already got the clue from the um, blueprint that I believe in August, we're going to, as a community, we're going to vote on the schedule for uh, the, the 36 month core airdrop. So we actually get the vote on that as a community. So, um, you know, Sologenic vision is to be a community. How could it really be a community unless the people involved can have their voice heard on chain? That's what Cosmos SDK is going to bring to Corium. So super exciting. Tendermint Core is also something you should look into. Uh, uh, Reza has a tweet basically saying that Sologenic is going to be using the uh, Tendermint Core. But also some more bullish news for, uh, you know, XRP ledger tokens. Is Binance going to start listing XRPL tokens? Uh, said Jack. Um, when, did, when did CZ, this is the CEO of Binance, uh, he started to follow uh, the CTO of Casino Coin. Is Casino Coin going to be the first one? Uh, I believe probably all the XRP ledger coins are probably list on Binance at the same time. Uh, including Solo. I think they're going to list Solo first, then Corium will come probably after. But you have to remember about the MasterCard, Binance X, and, and Ripple X bring join the Blockchain Education Alliance. So Binance and Ripple have a lot of ties together. Another thing you guys should definitely watch these videos on um, Ethan and X bring and, and the XRP SDK. Because with, you know how the Cosmos SDK comes with Tendermint Core, basically as a package deal and IBC protocol. 
Well, in the XRP, in the XRP SDK, the interledger is included. So that's how all both of these are going to come together um, when you mix the interledger with basically the Cosmos SDK, you know, game over time, uh, my opinion. But he also talks about in this video right here, uh, Ethan talks about, you actually find a, a, a photo of Ethan, the director of Xpring, he came from Facebook. But this guy with the CEO of Binance and Michael Arrington, all three of them hanging out. So I do know that, you know, there's something there with the XRP DeFi co tokens and Binance. So don't be surprised when Binance announces or listing uh, these XRPL tokens. But yeah, watch these because look, you see Ethan Beard talks launch of Xpring platform for SDK for XRP and ILP. So you got to know about, you know, Xpring. Xpring is a big, big uh, part in this whole story. Let's shout out some community members. So XRP Forest says the name Sologenic is sexy. The name Corium is sexy. If the above two names doesn't arouse you, no woman, man, token, or coin will ever arouse you. If you still can't get it, you'll never get it. I agree. I agree. Sologenic, you know, I think it's going to look really good on a t-shirt. And Corium sounds even more, you know, elite. That sounds like some luxury, you know, um, it sounds, you know, <laughs> I know, I know what you're, I know what you're trying to say, man. So also we got Texas XRP boy. He knows. Sologenic, ask me anything. Bullish as, can't say that word today. By the way, if you know, you know. Think. Let's say think logically. I can lead you to the water, but I can't make you drink it. XRP ledger, cross-chain bridges, the biggest decks on the biggest ledger. Tidal waves and explosion emojis. Shout out to Texas XRP boys. Shout out to XRP force. Keep putting out the good bullish sologenic content because more people got to know. More people got to know. All right, everybody, have an awesome day. Uh, hop into the Discord. The link will be below. And uh, we'll be talking about all this stuff, guys. Everybody have an awesome day and peace.